Hey guys, it's Jamie, and for today's video I wanted to talk to you guys about a few things that I've learned in the past year because I don't know how many of you guys know this, but um, tomorrow I'm going to be turning 17 and I have learned a lot of stuff in the past year. And I hope that you guys have learned stuff too, and if you all watch this video, then you can learn more stuff um, that you can incorporate incorporate that you can incorporate into your life too. So I wanted to share these things with you guys so that you learn and I learn and that we all just learn stuff that other people have experienced because 7 billion people in the world experience life in 7 billion different ways each day and I think that fact is actually really cool and really fascinating. Number one, if there's a place you want to go or a person you want to meet, do it. It's definitely worth the money. Number two, hang out with a bunch of different types of people. If you are a person who is really into art, try to hang out with someone who's into music or someone who's into fashion or someone who's really intellectual. Or Baby jocks. Damn. Number three, keep chapstick under your bed. It's really helpful for those long nights where you're just sitting in bed and watching Netflix and watching YouTube videos and watching TV at the same time and texting at the same time. And you don't want to get up when your lips are chapped. Where? Whatever. Wherever. Hello? Hey, you want to go shopping? No, I'm saving up for a 30mm lens and a DSLR Nikon camera. What? I can't go shopping. Number six. <laughs> you don't need to text back right away. Number seven. Don't do your homework in bed because then when you actually go to bed, you'll only be concentrating on things that you did in bed earlier that day, like homework, and you won't be able to concentrate on actually falling asleep. Number eight, go to bed early. You're probably a teenager, and teenagers need about eight hours of sleep to function, so going to bed at 12 is not gonna help with that. A blog to speak. Study for more than two minutes. Trust me, you do not want to know what I got in my biology midterm. Number 10. Read a book. It'll help you out things like the SATs and the ACTs. And also, I like promoting Tyler Oakley. Number 11. Go for a run. Alright. Number 12. This is 10, but I don't have an extra two fingers. Watch a movie with your family. Well, I can't do that right now because my brothers are both at college and my parents are working. But whenever you have the free time, make sure to watch a movie with your family once in a while and actually get to spend time with them. Because I don't get to do that very often and it's really nice to just be able to hang out and chill with your family. Number 13. Don't procrastinate. It'll come back and bite you when you least expect it. Number 14. Try to eat healthily. Like this. Just kidding. This isn't real cheese. But seriously, eat something healthy because then you'll feel much better afterwards and you won't be eating anything artificial like what I just showed you or like a fruit roll up or gummy worms or anything. Eat carrots and broccoli and corn and I don't know what I'm doing with my hands, but just eat healthily. It'll make you feel better. 15. Don't do something if it's not right for you. Number 16. Take a bath. It's really soothing, but don't use bath bombs because those are expensive. And lastly, number 17. This one might seem like a no-brainer because you are yourself all the time, but just remember to just keep acting, not even acting, just keep being yourself and doing what you do because you're the only you and you can't be a copy of anyone else, so just keep doing you. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. It was just a short little video to show you guys that you can actually learn a lot in a year's worth of time. 365 days, 365 days. Yeah. Um, but I hope you guys liked that video. Um, please give it a thumbs up and comment if you have any suggestions for more videos. And I know the lighting was pretty bad for some of the parts, but don't worry, that's going to get fixed soon. So I'll see you guys next time. Bye!